Thank y'all. I mean, which, it's better than nothing. I'll take it. And I am going back to work, but the thing is, you can still get paid unemployment if you're working less than a certain amount of hours. And since I'm not in full-time work, I'm part-time, and I'm making money off tips, I still qualify. Um, I won't get any back pay because I'm a dumbass and forgot to request my weeks of unemployment. <laughs> so I just reopened the claim. Hey, Danielle. So that's why I had to call them today. So, yeah. Oh, well. I'm, I'm done fighting, bro. I'm so done with it. I don't care. I'm mentally freaking drained as hell. I'm not fighting shit anymore. I don't give a fuck. Hey, Jamie. Yeah, I don't care. I'm so freaking far behind on bills and everything i owe a bunch of money for probation i asked if i could if i could just sit out the re remainder of my time in jail <laughs> and i can but the issue is is it won't get dropped from my record like right now this charge is supposed to get dropped from my record and i asked her today i was like how long would i have to be in jail for and she said whatever the first offer was which they offered me 10 days in jail with two days time served. So an additional eight days in jail. But the issue is, is it won't get dropped from my record. So. Otherwise I'd do that, send my ass to jail right now. <laughs> because it's just getting so expensive. It's probation, like that's the only thing. I don't have a problem doing probation, but I have to spend like $160 a month paying probation fees between two counties right now. Hey, was someone to calculate 392 times four? And let me know what that is. Guys, I'm going to become a 1568. Oh, that's really good right there. That, like, makes me have, like, be able to take a freaking deep breath. They allow community service. Yeah, so I have to do community service also. But I'm planning on paying my community service, which I have to pay $180 for community service. Because it's either $180 or 24 hours of community service. Fuck that. I ain't doing no 24 hours of community service. I'll pay that 180. I have to do community service either way. You either have to do the 24 hours of community service or you have to pay the fee. They're not giving me back pay because I had to reopen my claim because I forgot to freaking request weeks of unemployment. <laughs> my back hurts. Oh well, I don't care. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fight it. I don't give two shits. I'm just happy and blessed that I get unemployment. I've been denied for unemployment so many times, and I know you guys were like, "Ali, apply for unemployment. Apply for unemployment. Apply for unemployment." And I was like, "No." I was like being stubborn about it because I was like, "They're not gonna approve me," and they did. So, thank y'all for convincing me to do it. finally getting money i'm getting money from them thank god but i think you know what sucks though i'm pretty sure that they only have to pay like a yearly fee for money from them thank god but i think you know what sucks though i'm pretty sure that they only have to pay like a yearly fee Um, I asked 
<laughs> I asked Austin if he would let me borrow 200 bucks and he of course said no, but it was worth a shot. He was like, no, you're working now. I'm like, do you know how hard it is? Like it's gonna take me forever to come up with freaking 200 extra dollars. Was the lady able to help last night? I don't know. She texted me and said, sorry, I fell asleep or whatever. And I texted her today and I was like, can you help me? Like, are you gonna help me? But then this is, it's gonna backfire in my face, y'all. This is how it's gonna backfire. They're gonna be like, oh my gosh, Allie was begging me for money and you just want my money and you're just using me for my money. Like when homegirl literally offered. That's what's gonna end up happening because that's what happens to me every single time. Like why fucking offer? Of course, like if you offer to help me and you're taking forever to help me when I'm on like a time crunch, of course I'm gonna be like, hello. I mean, I can't, I can't like knock it until she really doesn't, I guess. She definitely reached out to you. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. But it back every time, this happens every time. People always offer to help me with money. And then if they take forever at trying to help me when I'm like on a time crunch, where are we going? I just got home. And I'm exhausted, but I feel like I can't even, like, get sleep. Because I'm, like, I'm emotionally exhausted. More so than I am, like, physically exhausted. Like, emotionally or mentally exhausted. Sleep doesn't do any good. Like you can tell I'm I look like I'm going through it maybe because I am I need to be getting enough unemployment to cover my bills so definitely not all my bills but I do have that job so but with it not being full-time job so but with it not being full-time don't come after me, y'all, because y'all are going to be like, oh my God, we're going to call unemployment and tell them that you're working. You can hear it now. We're on the phone with unemployment as we speak, Allie, as we speak. No, that's not how it works, okay? Once I return to full-time, um, yeah, once I go to full-time work, that'll be different. I'm still actively, yeah, I got approved for unemployment. I need to do something. Um, I need to, fuck, what do I need to do? Oh, I need to go to workintexas.org or something. Yo, somebody buy me a damn freaking calendar because I cannot remember shit that I have to do. Where in the heck? <laughs> Losing it. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not going to get the back pay because I had to reopen my claim because I'm stupid and forgot to request for the week. Oh my gosh, y'all. Where in the heck? <laughs> Where in the world did I put my phone stand? Oh, here it is. Found it. Yeah, so I'm not going to get any back pay, which is fine, whatever. I'm grateful to even get something. But she said, like, my balance is still going to remain the same, you know? So I could have been getting it. Yeah. But nobody even contacted me and told me I was approved or anything. I'm over here thinking that they're still working on it. Fashioned, but I, I have to have it like written down. Oh my gosh, hold on. <gasps> Sorry, <laughs> that was dramatic. I have to go to a drug to do a drug test tomorrow, and I work at ten thirty. I guess if I go at seven, she said between seven and four, so I'll have to go to at seven. That gas was so dramatic. <laughs> Oh, 
Thank God I don't do drugs, y'all. That would suck. That would be another stressor. <laughs> what if, like, my question is, like, what if somebody that's on probation is, like, literally addicted to drugs? Like, they can't afford to go to rehab or something, and they're literally addicted to drugs. Like, you can't, like, if you're addicted to something, you can't just stop them, right? I should have just done it today. Yeah. No, you see, that would have made too much sense, Joanne. Why would they do that? Come on now. No, you have to do it like there's certain people that like come there to do it. And I guess only on like Wednesdays and Thursdays or something. It's so awkward. Hold on. I freaking hate doing the drug test because you literally have to, you have to pull your pants down to your knees and like there's somebody in there staring at you the whole time. You have to pull your pants down to your knees. You have to put your shirt under your bra. I'm like, I can't even freaking hide my shit. I think you get paid bi-weekly, but you get weekly payment. It's $3.92 a week, so essentially that'll be like my rent. <laughs> I'll have a little extra left over, but that would be considered like my rent payment, which like, fuck, that's one of my big bills. Pay my rent. Hell yeah. I just wish they were paying directly. Um, I don't have a... <sighs> Do I, I do have a printer. I don't know how to work it though, to be honest. <laughs> it's I think it's like a cordless printer. Oh, I don't know. Maybe you could help me. Because I have my laptop. I think it's like... What's this? I think this thing was expensive as hell too. Because I it's a photo printer, I think. Well, I don't know how to work it. We're not gonna do this right now, I'm not in the mood. <laughs> but I do have a printer, I just need to figure out how to operate it. I don't know how to eat either, yeah, I have no idea. I've used it before though, so I must have figured it out one way or another. <sighs> All right, anywho, back to bed we go. <laughs> I'm so tired. I work today at, what time do I work? How court went? I didn't go to court. Court got postponed. What day is it? Tuesday 4. Oh, thank God. What if it said like 1030 or something? I would have cried. Um, yeah, uh, my attorney postponed court. And it's not until next month now. As long as it doesn't keep getting postponed. But I think he's postponing it for good reason. I'm pretty sure he postponed it because um, he doesn't have, like, all the evidence and stuff. And he can't really fight that much. So I need him to fight it. I need that taken away. If this gets taken off, I'll be Gucci because then in May I'll be done with probation and that'll be that. I'll be done. Anywho, how's everybody else doing? <laughs> so tired oh my gosh work in texas hold up <sighs> i used to make like shirts and sell them and that's why i have that photo printer is it it's not it's oh i don't know i don't think it's a photo printer yeah it is i don't know it's just a printer fuck <laughs> i need this all to be over you're telling me I need to register in here. Did I already register? I don't even freaking know. <laughs> oh, will this help me find a job? Like I already have a job, but it's not a full-time job and I mean, heck. 
Honestly, last night was a lot better. I, I need to give it a fair shot. It's really hard to like go back in the restaurant industry after, especially after going to college. Like you don't want to put your pride to the side, you know? It almost like makes you feel like a loser. I don't know. <laughs> was work better yesterday? Was she and asked Chelsea to help you with what? Oh, with the shirts. <laughs> yeah that girl i even told her she she frustrated me so bad i still get frustrated because like i would tell her like why don't you like while she didn't have a job i was like why don't you sell shirts like people do good with that like open yourself a little boutique where you make the shirts you know you don't even have to have like people like custom shirts like that could be one of your options but literally just like do a little boutique, come up with like cute little sayings on shirts and stuff and freaking do them. I mean, she's good at making them and she would never want to do that. But like at the same time, she really didn't like, she really wasn't in a rush to get a job. You know, she wasn't really in a rush to make money. Like all of her big bills were taken care of by Silas. So it's like, I guess it makes sense. But then there's me where I'm like, I will literally freaking. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was going to say, I'll literally <laughs> You guys are going to take this. I'll literally sell pussy on a platter for money right now. I'm kidding, guys. I'm kidding. Don't post this on Reddit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Somebody laugh at me. Shady things lately. <laughs> she doesn't need to work. I know. And there's me over here. I'm freaking stressed to the freaking max. I need... Hold on. I need, um... I need to take some, some lessons from Gabby. Also, does anybody know why Danny's back in the hospital? And honestly, what she does make will probably just cover daycare. Oh, absolutely. Well, no, she only pays $20 a day, I think. I don't remember if it was a day or a week. I think $20 a day. Yeah, $20 a day at her daycare. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand. I logged on this morning, so i I broke down and messaged freaking Zach. I'm so stupid. I sound so pathetic. I need to surround myself by empowering females. That's what I need. I literally broke down and I was like, I'm miserable without you. Gosh, I feed these guys egos. I did the same shit today. I thought about just like calling and removing my number from his phone. I would probably severely regret that, wouldn't I? I mean, he's not doing anything for me right now, but he doesn't have to. That's the thing. That's the thing with unconditional love, you know? And I never knew unconditional love really before Jay. Jay was like the first person. And then um, Zach. The thing is, is like they don't have to be doing anything for me. And I said like, if I hold it down here, out here for like the next two years for Zach to get out, I'll do that to be able to enjoy like the next 50 years with him. Exactly, Haley. The thing is, it's like I know I deserve so much better, but I don't want better. <laughs> That's like the thing.
to him and see how the good thing is, it's like, he doesn't want to be with me. <laughs> That's the issue. Like I sent him messages, I think on Sunday, well he would have already received them by now if he didn't respond or anything, so. Hey Alexa, play half of my hometown. Half of my hometown. Everybody like leaves me so easily and it's so fucking depressing. <laughs> Which I don't understand. busy during the day. Like if I'm gonna only have this one job, I need to figure out what to do to keep myself busy throughout the day. Cause this whole sleeping all the time, it's depressing as hell. This morning was breakfast. I should probably eat before I go. Uh, I don't know. I'm a little hungry. <laughs> don't have an appetite. <sighs> what am I doing? I don't know. I'm sad.
Hey Alexa, play Illinois by Brett Young. Is that his name? Oh. Go and listen to Brett Young and new Amazon Music Unlimited on this Echo Dot. It's free for 30 days, then $5.99 a month until you cancel. Terms in the Alexa app. Should I start your free trial and play Brett Young? No. Alexa, play okay. Illinois. You can sign up anytime oh, by she's saying so dumb. sign up for Amazon Music Unlimited. Hey Alexa. Play Illinois. Shuffling Illinois and similar songs on Amazon. Hardcore, Music. not even high yet. See, what? Hey Alexa, play Illinois by Brett Young. Just want music by Brett Young? Oh my gosh, I Have hate Amazon her. Music Unlimited on this She's the account. worst. It's free for 30 days, then $5.99 a month until you cancel. Terms in the Alexa app. Should I start your free trial and play Brett Young? No. Okay, you can sign up anytime by saying, sign up for Amazon Music Unlimited. You're slipping off your shoe while the dashboard speaks. Sing every word of that room. I want to be that song that gets you high, makes you dance, makes you fall. That melody, real white tears, wants to disappear. I'm okay. I'm just in my feels today, but I song. Hey Alexa, next song. Hey decomposing Scooby Snack. Hey Alexa, play Mountain with a View. Mountain with a View by Kelsey Ballerini from Apple Music. Maybe probation was okay. I mean, typical. Literally, it's so pointless. I asked her if I could serve the rest of my time in jail. <laughs> and I can, but the issue is, is it won't get taken off my record. I need to become best friends with Kelsey Ballerini. She seems like one of those empowering females. I need to surround myself with those. How do you get over a marriage like that, you know? Like that easily. See, I need to surround myself with her. She is, Patrick. I want to become her best friend. But I think I'm lying. I need her advice. I need to know how she got over her marriage that quick. Or like not that quick, but in general, how she got over it. I need to know. <laughs> I'm weak. <laughs> like I wish I could just leave a relationship like the first instance that I get treated wrong, you know, but I don't ever. Like Jay's been treating me wrong for like a year. Zach's treated me wrong. Sorry, I'm changing real quick. Like, it should be easy to move on from people that treat you poorly, but it's not for me. I don't get it. I guess like, I don't know. I guess I don't really know my worth and I guess that comes with that. I don't know.
Um, I have to be at work by four. And I want to tan and eat before I go to work. I should probably put these nuggets in the dang air fryer so they can get started. to like have to constantly cover up my dang work shirt on here. It's it hot. <laughs> nice training because I don't have to like really do anything before I leave and I get to leave early. <laughs> I'm working seven days in a row. They kept changing my Friday schedule. They kept scheduling me off and then they put me back on and then they scheduled me off again. So then I'm picking up a shift. <laughs> I'm like y'all might as well have just kept me on. It's okay, I haven't heard from him. But honestly, like, he low-key pissed me off. Um. Hey, Sam. Hey. Um, dude. Did I say that right? Hey, Jennifer. Like, maybe I'm being insensitive with that situation, but, like, he pissed me off. Like, how are you gonna, how am I gonna freaking explain my feelings to someone? Like, oh, everybody walks away, and nobody stays in my life long term. And whether it's a romantic relationship, they walk away, or whether it's a friend, they walk away. And him and I were just friends, but, like, to me, that's dumb. How are you gonna ruin a friendship with someone? Because you're sad, you know I don't know. We're all fucking sad, okay? We're all depressed. <laughs> it's freaking hot. I need to remember that it's a damn sticker. I'm trying to track my tanning progress and I keep forgetting wear this little sticker thing. I wonder if I put it on now if it'll stick. Come on, hello. See, it's a little butterfly sticker. I wonder if it'll stay. Oh, shit. Wow. You're always getting these dang guys hooked. Okay, but my question <laughs> Why do I always get the wrong guys hooked? That's what I want to know. It's never the guy I want to be hooked. So how do I get the guy I want to be hooked? Like literally, the two guys I want. <laughs> Neither of them want me. Zach's always like, I love you forever, Allie, I swear. No, don't miss me with that bullshit. Wait, hold on. My hubby actually asked if I knew who you were yesterday. Oh, brother. Why? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I haven't seen the drama between them this morning. I know that Danny and Aaron were both in the hospital. I guess they were talking about you in this telegram group he's in. <laughs> what, what telegram group? For TikTok or something else? Oh, brother. <laughs> Oh, 
That's kind of funny. Like I was saying, all y'all, he was like, there is this new drama with this Gabby, Danny, and Allie girl you'd be interested in. <laughs> and you're probably like, no, let me give you the teeth. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's funny. Imagine your freaking boyfriend breaking up with you because of drama going on about you that you didn't really start. <laughs> you totally did. That's so funny. <laughs> <sighs> my whitening kit should be here and I was gonna use it on Austin but I forget like you put the light in your mouth like you put the gel on the light and then you put it in your mouth and I'm like I ain't about to mix saliva with him like that what time is it <laughs> what time is it they owe the hotel $400 for what are they in Florida I thought they were leaving today they were talking about your mod alley's fan page blocking everyone. They don't really even block that many people. Gabby's mom is based. Dude, oh my god, I gotta I gotta watch this shit. Hold up. Are they on still or no? <laughs> Why does Jay always read my messages and never respond? <laughs> Cause he doesn't want you bitch, move the fuck on. Hold on. I'm in my feels today and I just wanna cry. I haven't had a good cry in a while. Probably because they freaking left a mess. What account is it? Oh, found it. So are they in Florida? When are they going to damn Florida? They're still at the hotel, huh? Oh, damn it. Let's pause. What has happened? Tomorrow, but they said Tuesday. Whatever. See, you really think they're gonna go? As when I said, does he really have back pain, guys, or is it an excuse for him to not work? <laughs> I didn't realize Cam was in the room when those awful things were said. Well, awful things were said. Oh, gosh. I wish we could watch, like, I wish we could, like, go back. You missing the crazy night? Every time I tune into them, I get yelled at. You guys don't like it when I watch them, so I stopped. Everybody's saying it's not good to do around your kids. Bro, this is, if they do this on camera around him think about what they do off camera she said they aren't moving there it's a vacation so <laughs> where are they gonna go <laughs> genuine question if they're not moving there and they're going to stay in Illinois. Where are they going to go? <laughs> she said they're coming back to Illinois. Gabby said she had a plan. Yeah, her plan consists of you guys donating money to her. She shows you all what she wants you to see. Wake up, people. What? No, she shows everything, I feel like. But she wants us to see everything. Gosh, that nose ring. Doesn't that nose ring just drive y'all crazy? I'd send you money before anyone else on TikTok. I appreciate that. I do. The thing with me, though, too, like, 
I have no issues showing everybody where each dime is going to. <laughs> like, seriously. And she said her mom doesn't want Aaron there. What the heck? <laughs> I would never date or marry somebody that my family would be like that. I give our close to my family now, I don't care, but if I were like had a good relationship with my family, I wouldn't do that. Trust me. That would trust suck. Me, your parents not here. Bet you a million dollars. Me and Cameron are staying with my, with my mom and Aaron can go back home. I would rather be a single mom to have to deal with this baby girl you can't so do I'm that to respond to Aaron. you can't to take my mom when i get there no that's all i'm gonna do she does not understand Aaron will fight that in court exactly what i'm gonna do and there's no way and he's not gonna see it coming there her plan is to ditch Aaron. <laughs> what <laughs> where is she gonna ditch him at <laughs> hi jamie Somebody said, don't you love him? <laughs> Somebody said, Gabby, single life is amazing. It's really not that great. I'm not happy to be single over here. Well, I don't think telling the internet is going to make him not see it coming. <laughs> really? It's a problem that Gabby showing. She blames everybody. The internet's the issue. The trolls are the issue. I'm the issue. Aaron's the issue. Her mom's the issue. Everybody except for the person who is truly the issue. That's why her issues never change. <laughs> because the root of the problem is her. She just doesn't want to see that or believe it. She thinks that her and Cam will be able to stay in Florida and her mom will make Aaron go back. That's not how that works. He literally will go to court. Wait. My husband watching her in the other room. OMG, he needs his own drama. <laughs> Wait, he's watching her? Um, why is he not watching me? Hello? Go check that man. He said, don't swim with an ear infection. Oh, wait, no, his ear infection. So what, the whole time in Florida, we're just going to stay at home and... He can... Everybody's saying no swimming, please. Honestly, as long as he doesn't put his head underwater, I don't see an issue with it. He's on the AWB0209. He said the cold air isn't good either with his ears. Bro, how did y'all fucking survive? That's my question. Listen, you know what? Okay, like this is how... Beckiford just texted me, said I cut my hair off. He's going through a midlife crisis, isn't he? Um, anywho. Literally, this is how me and my brother were taught how to swim, okay? Like, ever since you had Auntie Auntie, you me crave it. You better get it. We're gonna see Beckiford's haircut. Um, but literally, <laughs> literally, um, hey, let me see your haircut. What is bad? No, let me see it. Oh. It does not look bad. You're just not used to it. Bro, it's been long for so long. It looks good. It doesn't look bad. Right, I'm gonna get huh? I'm gonna get new eyes. In the box? Yeah. Okay, all right, bye. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, yeah, how did y'all fucking survive? Because, like, how my, my grandpa taught me and my brother how to swim, he literally threw us in the pool and said, swim. Like, everybody's so sensitive now. Like, seriously, like, oh, you can't. Like, seriously, like, oh, you can't cold air or hurt your ear or you can't go swimming because your ear infect. Like, seriously, how did some of y'all fucking survive? I'm going on a rant, Beckaford. Are you? Yes, because everybody's commenting on Gabby's live because, like, her son has an ear infection. Mm -hmm. Everybody's like, oh, he can't go outside because the cold air hurts his ears or he can't go swimming because of his ears. And it's like, 
I was talking about how my grandpa taught me and my brother to swim, literally threw us in the freaking pool and said, swim. <laughs> like, yeah. how did you yeah. fucking survive? <laughs> yeah. That's how I learned to swim. Exactly. But like now in this day and age, like people are freaking 26 years old without freaking knowing how to swim. That's because everybody's soft as store-bought cotton. Is she muted or am I? It's been a shit show over here, man. That's great. They can't. Well, if you want to cut your hair, though. I was tired of that shit. <laughs> I wear a hat so much. I like getting the shower in the morning and wash the shit. And by lunch, it's greasy and nasty. Yeah. I just I I'm gonna be at work by four, and I want to tan before. I might just tan after because now I'm invested. I'll probably get off at like seven thirty or eight ish. Probably not even eight. Which how is she on? She's on the AWB zero two zero nine. Oh my gosh, flying with sinus congestion and ear infection, both are brutal. Y'all are fucking weak as shit. So somebody just commented. You can swim with an ear infection. They make oh, things to put in your ears. But not like... only that, like, I doubt he'll even be going underwater. Right. Like, seriously. He's been on antibiotics for 24 hours, all. Camry has. What, is, what does that matter? Confused. Uh, that poor little boy. I'm watching you at work, and my manager is so mean. I love it. Just be like, you gotta understand. Like, you don't know what's going down. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking job ain't important. I need to watch you. <laughs> you don't understand the importance of this shit. Like, if you need to fire me, I understand. <laughs> Charlie. What you doing, baby? Come on. Yes. Come on. Going to a trailer unless Oh my god, fat cat. Why would she fly if she's moving somewhere? That's why, that's why I have the money. What? Right? I know that's what it I know. You feel me, Beckerford? Why yeah. would she if she's moving somewhere? I know. Can you move? Jesus Christ. Why I'm holding on to the money, not you. Holding on to the money? Where'd you get fucking money? Please tell me. They did it. They did it. They really donated money to her again. Beckford, did you know it's a probation violation to live on the streets? I cannot be homeless. Yeah. What am I going to do? Uh, nobody will fucking help me. Oh. <laughs> I know. I know, like, the other night, she gathered like eight hundred dollars from people but what the hell am i doing wrong i mean when you get help you're a piece of shit for it though remember literally so you know i i, I texted lisa i texted we're gonna have to drop it off give you a oh, oh my god i'm tired I Lisa said, Lisa just texted me. I said, we have to drop it off tonight. Where's Coco going? Are they fighting on live right now? Yeah. <laughs> we have to drop it off tonight. <laughs> so I'm wow. here. Wow. <laughs> wow, bro. Please tell Anthony did everything last night. He helped cool me. Cool story. Oh, hell no. Anthony was very, very helpful not her talking about Anthony to Aaron, her man. <laughs> she said, I'm so grateful for Anthony. Oh my gosh. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Definitely, Shelby. I need to go get a bag. I'm Just take him out. I believe it. Three tags, everybody. Oh, what are you doing? Aaron, You're gonna pay for this shit. Aaron, $69 a bag. Aaron, you can take on a carry-on. Yeah, you already have one. It's Cameron's bag. I have my luggage bag. That's my carry-on. But the thing is, he doesn't want to leave her. 
<laughs> like really? You'd rather do this all day long, every day? I bet I fucking don't. Why not, Beckerford? <laughs> I'm not gonna argue with somebody every day. Take him and let Life me... is too short for that shit. Oh, and it is. It's so soft. I love it. That's why I bought it. Just take Cameron somewhere. Me too, Bridget. I really don't know if they're going to afford it, though. Like, I don't know. Do you know? Where are they supposed to be going in Florida? Huh? Where are they supposed to be going in Florida? I think like Fort Myers or something, or like by there. Not her pawning the kid off, I know. Well, so no, we're even that live, we're literally. Um, I will literally drive to Fort Myers and find her and put her in a live. Do it. I what swear to God, I would. <laughs> it's not that far for me to drive to Fort Myers. Will you please? <laughs> If I find How are you going to find her? Oh my gosh, she's always at. on live. We'll definitely know where she's at. It's, if y'all find out where she's at, I will do it. That's fine, you can do that. <laughs> Don't give him ideas. Too late. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't give me that idea. That was mine. <laughs> Wait, they're supposed to be staying with a Carla, but rumor has it she's not going to be able to stay. Wait, what? I thought they were staying with her mom. <laughs> You need to stay out of my state. Don't <laughs> <laughs> send her over here to Texas. Uh uh, no. I'm sure they don't even know where they're going to stay. Literally. I bet the fuck I don't invite them over here. <laughs> You've got me, bit. <laughs> uh uh. <laughs> Uh-uh. That's right. No Gabby, uh, no Gabby, Florida. I'm going to start a campaign. Beck, I dare you to go find her and be like, oh my gosh, are you Gabby from TikTok? <laughs> she thinks she's famous already, so. <laughs> be like, be like, oh my God, are you that girl Gabby from TikTok? Yeah. Oh, so you're the one always talking shit to Allie, huh? Hmm? Oh my god. She she's famous in Florida. She told Danny to move with her. Danny told her to move in with her. Wait, 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 wait. What did Mama say? <laughs> no, no, I definitely don't need anybody else to take care of at all. Are you I, have care of me? I have a hard enough time taking care of myself. Will you take care of me? Huh? Will you take care of me? I done told you that. That you take care of me? Yeah. When did you say that shit? <laughs> you know, the one time at the place with the thing and the... Yeah, exactly. You're bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> well, if that's the case, rent's past due and so is car payment. I'll expect to cash up later. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I know. I'm here for it. I know. I expect that Reddit to be up within the hour. I not even. That's an there expectation. Are Reddit right now, typing it. If it doesn't happen, I'm gonna be disappointed. <laughs> she said 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Not even. Like, they're already there. <laughs> as soon as we finished that sentence. The video was recorded. It's being uploaded as we speak. <laughs> no, Mama, I cut all my hair off. So. I'd say it's already up, right? I got a, I got a wild hair up my ass this morning. I cut all my hair off, so I was tired of it. Need a Netflix documentary on them. I mean, this essentially is that. <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, if somebody recorded every single one of her lives and put it into a documentary, it would sell. <laughs> I'm just saying. But instead, she wants to write a dumbass book about right. her life struggles <laughs> that are no different than anybody else's life struggles. <laughs> 
that part. <laughs> Bro, she really just sent Aaron away with Cam instead of Anthony. Is Anthony still there? I'm so confused. Anthony's not there. Shut up. Stop. I don't want to hear that shit. Oh, there's Coco. <laughs> Coco's digging in the trash right now. Oh, well. Probably hadn't been fed in three days. <laughs> Literally. Anthony picked Danny at the hospital, but Danny's home now, right? Poor Aaron. But I've been trying to get him to leave her for like a year. <laughs> he ain't going in. No, I feel sorry for them too. That's why I tried to save them and then you guys came for me. Don't remember that shit? I didn't come for you. I know, not everybody did, but the majority of people did. <laughs> Everybody's like, she's just doing this for money and clout. Bro, if I was doing this for money, why the hell is my rent not paid? <laughs> that part. <laughs> At least you have a job. Oh, yeah? Oh my gosh, I got approved for unemployment. Did you really? Mm hmm It's going to be 392 a week. Damn. I'm eating chicken nuggets. Right when I join, I get blocked. Wow. It's something, I mean, hello, it's my rent and a little extra. That's like, okay, we'll say rent and electricity. And I'll be working. You're not backdating it because I'm stupid and forgot to request it. <laughs> she said she has a bunch of stuff to do, but her foot hurts. So she's making excuses. When does it start? Um, I request my first week of payment, uh, January 3rd. I mean, it's going to be a minute, but at least I have a job now. I'm ready to freaking make my own tips. This whole training shit, ugh. Just put me on the fucking floor. I'll figure this shit out on my own. What? Something. You want to go swimming? You literally ran to the pool. <laughs> Sabrina, really, Sabrina Brown. You wanna fucking go? <laughs> what is Sabrina say? Brown? Come on. It's so funny because she thinks she's so scary. She thinks she's so scary, but then people go up there and she's like, I don't have anything to say. <laughs> like, she'll do this shit. She does this with me all the time. She will talk her shit like this and then I'll go in the box or battle her or something and she just won't have anything to say to me. Uh-huh. She's calling Sabrina Brown out. Who's that? Oh, I think she's going to show the message, hopefully. What is it? How do they know they owe the hotel four hundred dollars?
I want to know what they said. <laughs> you know what I said to my friend Maddie the other day? <laughs> I said, she, we were talking about Danny and Gabby. And I was like, I just know that they don't wipe from front to back. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Outlandish. I just know it. They're gross. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Mama said, let me have a box. The fact that <laughs> the fact that she let Anthony watch Cam by himself last night while she was at the hospital. Like, really? Homie's got an SA charge. Huh? Yeah. That's how you swear. Swear. Whoa. That's cool. Cool story, bro. Ew, Aaron is so gross. That's my man's. That's what started the original beef between me and Gabby. She thinks I want her man's. Hell yeah. There's my handsome man's. Jump on him. My pookie bear. How long have I been on? Not too long. Maybe like an hour-ish. Actually, I can tell you. Hold on. <laughs> 46 minutes. Alright, so what are we doing? Sitting around. You're gonna take your car to Rockford, Gabby. I, yeah, I, I don't know. What do you want to do? Oh, good God. Get everyone out of here. <laughs> she said, Get everyone out of here. Oh, hell no. Down my fucking throat. Down your throat? Yes. You're, you're literally giving me a really bad anxiety attack. Oh, here we go. She better go to the hospital. It's your, it, it, it's a problem when you have anxiety, though. You're faking. I told you, take. Uh huh. Sounds about right. I could probably tan before. I don't want to wait till after work to tan. As long as you don't FaceTime nobody while you're tanning. <laughs> you enjoy the view. Don't even play. <laughs> Accidentally flashed back, y'all. She did. I've seen a whole right. kitty. <laughs> she says it was an accident. Oh my gosh. Don't even. <laughs> you wish. There's, you another wish. Reddit, there's another Reddit post for him today. <laughs> oh yeah. I'm surprised it's not already on there because I made that statement a while back. Noise complaints. I know, right? Is that why Vaccine's in a better mood today? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was like what, like two weeks ago, a week and a half ago. I don't know. That was like I don't know. That was a week and a half ago. Gosh. Okay, we gotta go tan, and my thing's about to die. Damn it. Y'all are going to have to keep me updated. And the furniture and everything has dents. What the hell? Not dents. Huh? Not dents in the furniture.
Y'all, my head feels so fucking weird. I haven't cut my hair in like six months. Everybody says I'm just like Danny and Gabby. Huh? That's what everybody says on Reddit, that I'm just like Danny and Gabby. <laughs> Aren't I? No. <laughs> no. no. You don't see the resemblance? I mean, hell, we all dry bag, right? I don't think I dry bag because I literally come out and say, y'all help me. <laughs> That's not really dry begging. Dry begging is more like, I wish I could have it. Right. <laughs> oh my gosh, I feel so bloated. This job just annoys the shit out of me. I forgot my apron in my car yesterday. I actually didn't really like forget it. I purposely left it in there because I didn't know that they were going to have me waiting tables. They haven't shown me anything. The person that trained, trained me last night, she didn't tell me shit. She was like, oh, I'm not really showing you anything. You think? Oh, Jesus. Gosh, it's nice out and I have to go to work. I mean, let's be honest. I wouldn't be outside anyways. <laughs> but... It's the principal. <laughs> it's gonna take hours to clean. Did I sleep all day? Yeah, pretty much. Cause I'm the What did you say? I didn't blame you. I did too. I didn't go to sleep till six forty-five this morning. My alarm went off at seven thirty. And I woke up, my chest was killing me, so I was like, fuck it. I turned my alarm off. I was like, oh, you know, I'll sleep for another five, ten minutes. <laughs> my ass didn't wake up till 12.45. Oh, hey, did you go to the doctor yesterday? No, they're going to see me tomorrow. So my You better fucking go. My daughter wasn't there yesterday. You said you already had it scheduled. <laughs> yeah, she had to call out because her kid was sick. So she <laughs> scheduled me for tomorrow. Bro, get the fuck out of my way. Oh, gosh, don't even get me started. Oh, that was bad size. Hey, Rach, baby. Rach, I was going to text you and ask you where the hell you've been. Again, I'm a brand new man. I'm in my feels today. Have I been to the doctor? I go Thursday. I need to let them know because I'm going to probably be late to work on Thursday. I work at 4.30, but I have an appointment at 4. So, if they have an issue with it, I'll fight them. When I need a favor, God, I need a favor. I need a few of them. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I need to go. I know, and apparently I don't have a psychiatrist anymore because I guess she doesn't take my new insurance. Even though it's the same exact fucking insurance that I had before. Like before I had Blue Cross Blue Shield of Illinois, now I have Blue Cross Blue Shield of Texas. But somehow, someway she doesn't take it, which is fine because she wasn't very good anyways. But if, my, if I'm gonna have my primary care doctor prescribe me medication for that shit, cause she doesn't specialize in that, then I'm gonna have to be like, this is what we need to do. I'm gonna tell her, you need to take me off of Effexor, keep me on the same milligram of Lamotrigine, get me back on sertraline. She said, Aaron's screaming at Gabby and she's crying now. <sighs> Damn it, OMG Live is so bad. Why does this happen every time I leave? <laughs> Oh. I get a pregnancy. Oh, no. Don't know this one. Oh, my stomach is killing me. Oh, shit, y'all. I need to, like, undo my pants. We're going to take another pregnancy test. I'm just going to test, like, every single day. <laughs> um, what was I going to say? I'm not used to getting off work this late. They're like, you better get used to it. The 
glad I didn't wait to go tanning because I was gonna tan tonight. Glad I didn't do that. Hey Haven. Where the heck is Beckerford? Who said he was gonna get in the box? Hello. Anywho, I was telling Becca for this story. Hey, Olivia. But like a little into my shift tonight, all of a sudden I hear screaming and yelling at each other. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? The manager and this to-go guy are literally in the office having a yelling match with each other. And all I hear is like her being like at one of like the tables. And we like go up to him because again i'm nosy so i had to like invite myself into the situation that didn't involve me and i was like yeah good and he was like i got fired like i guess he got fired for like being rude or whatever and he got fired for yelling at the manager or something and i was like I was like, oh, he's probably gonna get fired. And I told that to the person who was training me. I was like, he's definitely gonna get fired for the way he's talking to her right now. And they're like, oh, probably not. Like, this isn't the first time that they've gotten into a yelling match. Nope, I was right, he got fired. Y'all may have not heard any of that because I know my connection was bad. Hi, Julia. Gosh, am I gonna have to repeat that entire story? Did y'all hear that? Guys who called me tonight is Zach. He's like, I miss you so much. He's like, I love you. I miss me with that bullshit, bro. <laughs> Just kidding, because I freaking love the shit out of him. He's the worst. He's such a jerk. Dude, living so close to work is like the best thing ever. I live like five to seven minutes away. You only heard a little gosh okay fine i'll start from the beginning so i like walk to the back and all of a sudden i hear this manager and this to-go guy just god bless it my fucking connection again thing that sets me free i'm a lost cause Baby, don't waste your time on me. How did probation go? <laughs> it's so annoying. I asked if I could serve the rest of my time in jail. <laughs> That's how annoying it's becoming. Fuck is back, bro. Back at bird. It's back at bird. longer do I have until probation? Fucking May, bro. Yeah, I have until May for probation, but I don't know. I'm like, let, send my ass to fucking jail. I'm over it. But, I don't know. I'm like, let, send my ass to fucking jail. I'm over it. But, so I would have to spend eight additional days in jail but it would still remain on my record. That's the issue. I would I would spend eight days in jail to get out of this whole probation shit. It's expensive as hell too. But you know what's good? I got approved for unemployment. And I know you're like, oh, you're employed. No, that's not how it is. Like, cause it's part-time and it's tip. That's not how it is. Like, cause it's part-time and it's tip. That's not how it is. Like, cause it's part-time and it's tip. That's not how it is. Like, because it's part-time and it's tip. But I got approved for unemployment. And I know you're like, oh, you're employed. No, that's not how it is. Like, because it's part-time and it's tips. So 
So yeah, I'm gonna get an extra $1,500 a month from unemployment on top of this job. Hey, Gabby. But um, I'd rather just serve the rest of the time in jail because I'm paying probation fees in two different counties, which they didn't tell me that shit. They were like, oh, do you want to transfer counties? And I was like, yeah, I want to transfer counties, thinking this county was going to be closer. Well, for one, come to find out, it's like the same distance, just in opposite directions. But also, they didn't tell me I was going to have to pay two probation fees in two different counties. So I'm paying $60 a month in two counties instead of just paying $160 a month. Stupid. Hey, McKenna. I'd rather go to jail, honestly. If you've been in jail, you know it's not that bad. I'd rather them just send me to jail, honestly, but whatever. For eight days. But eight days in jail is like... It's gonna feel like forever. But I'd still rather them do that. You know how I've been, like, trash-talking the food? I got food. And it wasn't that bad, but it did make me feel kind of sick. Like it almost looks like the chicken's like undercooked. Oh shit. <gasps> Dude, I got a message from Maddie. <laughs> Somebody, this girl, okay, I used to be like okay friends with her, right? I mean, I wouldn't even consider her friends, like more so just like acquaintances. But whatever. She kept fucking up. And so I just, like, finally ended the friendship or whatever. Because I'm like, fuck this girl. Like, she was nothing but drama. Y'all know her, baddie or whatever, Kayla. Whatever you know her as. Anywho, I, I keep blocking her. And she thinks it's because, like, like, I'm just blocking her because she's fucking annoying as hell. Like, leave me alone. And she keeps messaging everybody. Like, tell Allie to unblock me. Tell Allie's bitch ass to unblock me. And so Maddie sent me a message um, about it. She messaged her, but then Chelsea did the same thing. Chelsea had a message too. So annoying. Yeah, I know. Taco Bell probably would have been better on my stomach, though, to be honest. And this food wasn't terrible, but that's annoying. Yeah, she literally is blowing up everybody's shit. Like, I'm not gonna unblock you. And it's not because I'm scared, it's because you're annoying. Work is okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I gotta tell you all this story. Hold on. Let me. I'm so confused. So confused. Where the heck? Oh, he did get them. Oh, he did get them. Confused. Where the heck? Oh, he did get them. Oh, he did get them. Oh, hey, Alexa, play She by Jelly Roll. Hey Alexa, play She by Jelly Roll. Hey Alexa, volume all the way up. Hey Alexa, volume all the way up. Oh damn, I left it in my car. Oh well, I'm not about to go get it. Oh, I can use this one. <laughs> use this thing ever actually I left my 
other one in my car. How's work been going? Oh yeah, I gotta tell you all the story. So I walk in the back, like in the kitchen area, and I just hear yelling from the office. What the heck? So it's a to-go guy and a manager, and they're like yelling at each other, and I just hear like, stop yelling, and then like as she was yelling at him, they're like, stop yelling, and then he's like, oh, I can get loud. And it was going crazy, whatever. And so like, I'm like over there eavesdropping, you know, of course, as I do. And um, then he walks out crying. And it's like, I do everything for this place. Fuck it, fuck this place. He's like, I'm going home. And then he comes back in because like, you can't just have a dramatic ending like that and not have a ride. <laughs> so he didn't have a ride. So he had to come back in and wait for his ride. And then we went over there and talked to him, and he was like, yeah, I got fired. She was the life of a party. On my story. And then they're like, apologizing, and we're like, it's not always like this, I swear. They're like, all the new people never want to come back. Yeah, I already kind of don't want to, but I have to. <laughs> I need to put this laundry away. Hey Paige. Yeah, Zach called me. He's like, I miss you. I told you, man. I told you. I told you you were gonna miss me one day. You didn't care. You didn't believe me. I told him. Nobody believed me. Somebody save me. Where the fuck is fucking Beck Beckett I literally FaceTimed him before I got on. He was like, hey, you want to get in the box? He's like, yeah. Where the fuck is he? Hey, Brent Aim. with Amazon. I cannot open this. I saw that actually. No, I don't usually get cleaning stuff on there, honestly. Oh, I guess it depends. No, not really though. I think I got like couch cleaner from there. <laughs> That's about it. But like tanning lotion is expensive, so this is this I'm scared to use. It's a tingle lotion. Hey, Katie. Ooh, it smells good. Maddie told me to get this. She said it's really good. This is like the sizzling one, peaches and cream, and then this one I always like. But I don't want to just use a tingle lotion, you know. So this one I'm almost out of. Tingle, yeah, it's gonna make me freaking look like a lobster for a while. You won your first battle, congrats. I keep my tanning lotion in the fridge. Call me fucking weird. I have more tanning lotion in my fridge than I do actual food. It keeps it better for longer, yeah. Oh my gosh, wait, let me see. Oh, dang it, I can't really tell. I put a sticker on 
but it kind of like fell off. But I don't know if it's still there. Don't do anything that sets me free. Lost cause, baby, don't waste your time on me. Search out my hopes and my dreams. Zach's supposed to call me back, so let's see. Like, 20 bucks says we're gonna end up getting to better because I'm a fucking weak ass bitch. We're gonna end up getting back together. I'm weak. And then it's gonna be the same thing all over again. He's gonna break up with me for something stupid. The thing is, like, I feel like I can't be open and honest with him about what's going on in my life. Because when I was, he broke up with me for it. Like, when I was like, oh yeah, I'm behind on bills and I don't have a job. He was like, we need a breakup because you're behind on bills and don't have a job. Like, does that even make sense? It does, it does it. It's like, I don't want to be the reason. Like, bro, you're not the reason. I need to stop being weak. I need to literally laugh in these guys' faces when they try to, like, get back with me after doing me dirty. I need to literally laugh in their faces and be like, ha, you wish. But no, I'm weak. I'm gonna throw the rest of this quesadilla away because it's making me sick. I do need to laugh in their faces, but I'm weak. <laughs> I used to have like a really good friend and she was like the most empowering person I've ever met in my life. Like she literally like surrounded herself with like very powerful people and like was very like business oriented and like she didn't care who you were like you weren't getting a chance with her you know and i loved that but her and i are friends before melissa turn your heart black for a little and you'll never go back no, but I, I do. Like, I just don't have it in me. Hey, Alexa! Hey, Alexa! Play Broadway Girls. Okay, we need a mop and then something else. Put this laundry away. Um, Austin dropped me off some mop pads. Damn it, One of my coworkers is kind of cute, right? And I told the person training me, I was like, ha, he's kind of cute. And she was like, well, he goes to school in Chicago, so he's only here for the holidays. I'm like, why does this always happen to me? There's two things that you're gonna find out. Uh, I need Beck to entertain you. Oh, I'm gonna kick his ass, hold on. So I can mop. <laughs> Did you hear me talking shit? <laughs> yep. Now. <laughs> I was sitting in here waiting on you to get back. <laughs> now. Now. Well, shit. Uh huh. Um, See what happened? What took you so long? You know, just things <laughs> and this and that, you know. Wait, hold on. Let me mop and entertain them, okay? Tell them a story. Tell them a story? Tell them a story! I don't know a damn story. What the hell I look like? Oh, damn. Y'all are out of luck. I don't tell stories. Hey, 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 calm down, calm it down. Can't be telling all my secrets on here now.
Why are you telling them the story? We're talking. You you go do your thing. Why are you paused? Paused? Yeah, your screen says paused. Hold on. Okay, can you see me? Yeah. Okay. Hold on, I gotta get another mop pad. Well, why are you fucking up mop pads? What? They don't they don't teach you how to mop at the restaurant? No, we don't mop. <laughs> we just sleep. <laughs> I don't hear storytelling. There's no stories being told right now. I know. Tell a story. Huh? Tell a story. What story? Here's what everybody's going to leave because you're not entertaining them. They're not going to leave. Oh, my goodness. They're enjoying the view. Except oh for Paige. She's just picking on me. I see you, Paige. I'm sorry I left y'all with him. Listen. Listen, Linda. Oh, you're not listening. <laughs> you're doing fucking shit being talked. Uh, huh? <laughs> I know, Paige. I'm so sorry. Paige, how yeah, dare you? Ain't that great. How dare you, Paige? Paige knows what he's talking about. Uh huh. Told you. You gotta be entertaining. Tell a story. It doesn't have to make sense. Paige, listen. <laughs> I don't tell stories. Oh my gosh. Tell a story about something that's happened to you. Hell no, I didn't get paid. paid much. What? My rent paid. <laughs> Tell a story about the what? first date you went on. T Tell us about Everybody has an awkward first date story. Do you know how long ago that was? I don't remember that story. Okay, well, tell us something. <laughs> if I don't die first, Jesus. Are you uh, vaping? Huh? Are you vaping? Absolutely not. You're lying. That's not good for your heart. What? I didn't do nothing. Yeah, you're vaping, bro. Huh? You're vaping. What are you talking about? Really? You don't think I just heard you put your vape down? That was a quarter. See, look, I got a quarter in my hand. Yeah. I'm sure you do. Paige, stop it. Damn. See? Paige is a girl's girl. <sighs> That's not good for your heart, stupid. You can't complain about chest pain and fucking vape. Listen, if I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die happy. What? If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die happy doing something. Okay, wrong. but you shouldn't die at the age of 36. <gasps> Who says I make it to 36? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Telling you about your children? Uh, huh? We're gonna use that shit against you every what? time. Oh, and there goes the restriction. What? I got your live restricted. Age restricted? Leave and come back. What? Oh. Dude, he gave me a notification. Oh, he's the worst. Damn, I'm sucking at this mopping today. <gasps> Be on your best behavior. What? That's no fun. No fun. Mm. Mm. Mm.
Did you show everybody your haircut? Yeah, I did. It went bye-bye. Is that a receding hairline I see? I'm sure. No. <laughs> I just cut too much fucking hair off of it. One. <laughs> My hairline's been in the same spot since I was 16. So you've had a receding hairline since you were 16? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, it's freaking hot. That's because you're in there. I know. Oh, Jesus. I'm such a hype man. Ooh, somebody's got to be, especially with all these trash men I'm dealing with. Yes, I do. I have two kids, five and seven. And they are just like their daddy. Oh, gosh. Oh, I know. This world's not ready. <laughs> Get on a plane to Allie's. Come on, Beck. Come on, I'm Beck. I'm going to Texas in February. You can sleep on my couch. I'll sleep on the floor. I don't care. I don't have carpet. That might be uncomfy. Put a blanket on the floor. I feel like that's still not comfy. I guess you can sleep on my living room rug. Yeah. Damn, everybody's here for Beck. Not if you don't pay your rent, girl. Hey, I got proof for unemployment, okay? My apartment complex has got to wait a little longer for me to pay my damn rent. They're going to wait a little longer. I'm not here for Beck now. <laughs> Y'all better not be. Paige is definitely not here for me. Paige ratted me out. Hell yeah, she's a girl's girl. She's here for me, duh. As she should, as all 52 of y'all should be, but I know you're not. Um, Olivia, when I talked to them the other day, the kind of were just like, well, how are you going to get it? If you have to rob a bank, go rob a bank. We don't care. We just want our money. That's essentially what they said. God damn. Go rob a fucking... Um, had to talk to them. Go rob a bank? They won't have to worry about it. Yeah, but I'll have to worry about my freedom. I mean, they wouldn't have to worry about it is what I'm saying. I mean, you would. I would, though. That's what I'm saying. They don't care. I know, true. But I'm pretty sure they'd have to, like, I don't know. How does that work, okay? If someone, like, robs a bank, or I guess you would probably get caught instantly. What if somebody, like, robs somebody of money that they already pay for what they were going to pay for with that money? Does the company need to give the money back? What? <laughs> like, if somebody, like, robs a bank, okay? Say they rob a bank and they get away with it. Uh-huh. And say, like, I robbed a bank to get my rent money, okay? And you so went I and paid the rent. I robbed this bank. Hold on. I robbed this bank, and then I go to my apartment. I pay my rent. So, would my apartment, like, once they found out that money was stolen, would that the apartment have to give that money back? Really? No. Insurance. Will, it, the bank's insurance is going to cover whatever's stolen. But well, why do we got to go to jail for it, then? You Because you... Really? <laughs> I mean... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. Like, play that shit it. back for me real quick. Hold up. Yeah, let ask Jordan the question you just asked me. <laughs> no, if you rob a bank, okay, say I go and mm -hmm. rob a bank to get my money for my rent. Uh huh. I rob this bank. I go to my apartment. I make the payment. Does the apartment mm -hmm. have to pay that money back when they find out the money's stolen? Do they have to like give it back? Fuck no. So what you're saying is, I can do it. I mean, you can do it. I mean, you can do it, but you would have to suffer the consequences. Your rent would be paid, but you would be uh, living into jail. Yeah. Yeah, but maybe I could, I could bond myself out pretty quickly, I'm sure. Probably. <laughs> I feel like it's fine. I would never maybe we really shouldn't be trusted really by ourselves together. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> Well, I'm not allowed to go nowhere by myself. We really shouldn't be trusted together by ourselves. We would, especially, yeah. Especially not if we throw Allie in the mix, because she's she's gonna rob a bank. No, I'm talking about me and her. I ain't Jordan, talking about me Jordan and you. Jordan can drive the getaway tow truck. I could be like the responsible dad. He'd be the boring one. We'd have to get rid of him real quick. Ryder, what are you doing? Don't you dare. Listen. 
No, ma'am. But, but it may be against probation. I think it would be against probation. What? Bro, Rob a bank? Like, probably. I can't be homeless on probation. And I'm about to be homeless. But it's a probation violation. So not only am I going to be homeless, I'm also going to have another warrant out for my arrest. Okay. Jump off this bed and land on your head you want to. You're going to be full stupid then. Jump out of bed you want to. Good luck. Where is... Never mind. There it is. Hold on. I get unemployment, but the problem is, is they file eviction on the 1st. And unemployment, I don't even request my week of unemployment until January 3rd. Oh, shit. Yeah, and then this job, I don't quit training until Friday. But it's going to take me, like, a long-ass time to come up with all that money. Right. This isn't one of those freaking restaurants I'm going to be making an insane amount of money every night. Yeah. Hang on, Ryder. No, I'm pretty screwed in this situation, I must say. This situation's going to be really hard to get myself out of. <laughs> Hang on, Ryder. Let me put on some damn pants. It's five fucking degrees outside. Because it's a part-time job and it's based off tips. I'm taking that entire $8,000. They're paying me unemployment. I don't give two shits. I'm getting out unemployment one way or another. Hell yeah. Oh, Gabby, you didn't Hell no, I don't get views on this account. Ryder, I'm coming, dude. Oh, shit, it shiver me timbers outside, goddamn. Once you go to court, they essentially are like, yeah, we're kicking you out or we're not. More than likely, if I haven't paid, then they're going to kick me out. No, Julia, she was just fucking in here too, bro. I messaged her earlier and I was like, are you able to help me today? She never responded. <laughs> Julia, everybody fucking does that. Pisses me off. She's like, oh yeah, I got a $500,000 settlement check for my divorce. Yeah. I wish my ex-husband would have paid me $5,000 for a fucking divorce settlement. Get a little bit of my fucking money back, punk bitch. Mm -hmm. $500,000 settlement. She's like, I want to help people. I want to help you. Bitch has any money. bitch. You want to go shopping and sit the fuck on your ass. Shut up. That part. Why do people offer to help me if they were never planning on helping me? Right. Make that make sense. Don't even fucking offer. Rider, rider. All right, a snake going to come out of that hole and get your ass. Yeah, I'm already going to block her. Because I caught last night, she was like, let me know when you can talk. And so I tried to get a hold of her when I got off live. She didn't answer. But it was like, I don't know what time it was. It was Are like a little shit weird. in my flower bed, bro. Whatever. I gave her the benefit of the doubt. And then um, she texted me this morning and was like, hey, sorry, I fell asleep. And I was, or no, this was at like 11 last night. She was like, oh, I fell asleep. So I was like, um, it's okay. Right. And then she never responded. And then a few hours later, I was like, are you going to help me today? And she never said anything. Wait. I owe 1473 for rent. I already have an eviction notice. I literally called my apartment. She didn't give two fucks that I didn't have the money or needed a little bit of assistance. Um, and then I also owe $700 for my car. So whatever 1473 for 700 is how much I really need to come up with like yesterday. Like 2200 2300 Something like that, yeah. Did that electric fence get your ass? Listen, sis, it's five degrees outside. I need you to shit so we can go in the house. No, this is the second time somebody's offered to help me just this month alone with these bills and have, like, failed through. All right, Ryder. I'm done playing with you. Come on. In the house. Come on. Is that the baby or is that a different dog? No, it's the baby. The baby. Come on, Ryder, Ryder. Oh, and you've got mud. Awesome. All over your feet and you're tracking it in my fucking house. That's so great. I love that for me. So. I'm not going to do that.
that shit on you. Oh, my feet hurt. I have to wake up early again in the freaking morning. I have to go back to Baytown, which is like forever away from me. And then I have to do a stupid drug test. Then I work at 1030. Why can't they just fucking drug test me today? while I was there. They should have been able to. You were there for the ass crack at fucking dawn. I know, but like special people come in and I guess and do the drug testing. Cause they literally have to wash you tits and everything. Is that your girlfriend back? No, my fucking Wi Fi is fucking up down here. No, did you see the comment? Probably just seen that. Yeah, huh? I just seen it. I thought you were talking about why I kept posing. What? No, I don't I get that. I thought you meant why I kept posing. I've been forgetting to request my freaking weeks for unemployment. So they had to restart the policy or whatever. I figured it was going to get denied, to be honest. My Wi-Fi is trash. <laughs> you got that Wish Wi-Fi? Fuck yeah. I wish it would work. Yeah, you're side-eye waiting for somebody to laugh at that. <laughs> I literally need you. Yeah, come on, so... I think yeah, I get bi-weekly payments. It's gonna be an extra fifteen sixty eight a month. If you're yeah. working, you get unemployment. Incorrect, my friend. Incorrect. You have to work less than a certain amount of hours in order to receive unemployment. Mm-hmm. Well, dry again. Exactly. How do you call now, Atling. We're calling unemployment right now to notify them. You're on Reddit already. Literally. They're making the post right now. Right now. <laughs> yep. Have you Just checked like Reddit we were yet? Being for, streamed uh, the other the night. Huh? Have you checked Reddit yet to see if the post from earlier made it up yet? No, it's, it's not there. Crazy, right? I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. That's outlandish. Not working anymore. I am working. I but I get unemployment on top of work. Absolutely disappointing. That the post is like. Yep. We were whole ass That's getting streamed can... the other night. They're they're slacking. Again? When was oh, that? It's, it's oh yeah. Point, was that? I don't it, remember. It's to the point now that we do whatever we can to get on Reddit. It's just funny to me. Yeah. Now that I don't really have Zach to worry about, even though he keeps calling me and we're gonna end up getting back to bed together because I'm a weak ass bitch. You're gonna end up getting back with him. I you know love him. You better fucking not. She loves him. Um, I love my ex fiance, and that motherfucker can stay in Louisiana where he's at. Uh uh, I'll say it ain't so. You can't figure out Reddit, yeah. Reddit's kind of confusing. I didn't understand Reddit. What, Olivia? No, if I get back with him, there's gonna be, there's gonna be hella boundaries set. I'm gonna threaten him before I say yes. <laughs> I don't know. He may not even want to get back with me. Hell. But mm -hmm. the call tonight where he was like, I miss you. I love you so much. Yeah, them toxic motherfuckers be doing that. Every time. They're going to change for a couple of weeks and they go right back to that bullshit. So I'm like, should I just save myself the heartbreak? Or like, I don't know. Sometimes you have to give somebody a few chances before y'all get it right. Uh-uh. Oh. Well. Who told you that? Me. Mm, you lied. You <laughs> lied. Why do people call it a subreddit? Because you have like the Reddit, which is like I think like the actual page, and then a subreddit yeah. is like a post. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So you have a whole page on Reddit dedicated to your shit. Exactly. So I every, have like an every post they put about you is a subreddit. 
Everyone they add. I have an entire like profile or like page dedicated to me. So yeah. Somebody send that shit to me. Beck, text that shit to me. All you have to do is go on there and look up one of our uh, usernames and it'll pull it right up. Just type in Ali L. Ray with two E's at the end of Ray. Yeah, either hers or mine one and it'll bring up her page because I'm on there too. I don't think yours is on there though. Yeah. I don't, I don't think that, it says your name. Yeah, that's how I found it. I looked mine up. They tagged me in that. Them screenshots they took the other night when we were in here talking shit about that girl. Uh-huh. Yeah, they tagged me in it. And I guarantee you I'll find mine, too, from the other night us getting streamed. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. It's Good. Tell them bitches I said hey. But the thing is, um, I apologize to, like, the main ones. So it's really, like, slowed down a lot. Otherwise, we'd, like, they'd still be going at it. But they did like open the can of worms. So like once you're on Reddit, you're always gonna be posted on Reddit. Because there are probably people who are like, oh, we've been waiting for a page to be made about this girl. <laughs> I did care at the beginning. The only reason I cared though is because like they were putting Zach at risk. But that's what made him break up with me. So I was like, oh fuck that shit. Like I don't give two shits anymore. He literally broke up with me because of what people were saying about me. I'm like, okay, because I can control that. He's like, I just don't deal with messy bullshit. I'm like, weird. Neither do I. People are just fucking weird. <laughs> hey, Fram. Not me stuffing my face with Doritos at 10 o'clock at night. Dude, Letting my dog Doritos run around like a heathen. Uh, have you had Doritos dipped in that like creamy jalapeno cheese sauce stuff? Yeah, girl. Oh, they're so good. Best snack ever. Now you want Doritos? Girl, I got a whole thing in a cabinet. Come get some. I told Beck I'm going to become a tow truck driver. Best job in the world. I'm going to. I'm so serious. I feel like it would be a fun job, to be honest. Oh, it's so much fun. I need to make like 100000 a year. Like, sign me up. Hell yeah. I am on track. If my checks still look the same as they do now, at the beginning of the year, next year I'm on track to make a hundred and twenty thousand. What do I like most about my job? Hmm. <sighs> I honestly like how challenging my job is sometimes, honestly. Because not every recovery is the same. Um, sometimes you get to things and you you just kind of have to think. Like, how am I going to get this car out of this hole or this car out of this ditch? Or this tow truck out of this river? Did that one. That one took a second, but we made that bitch work. I went swimming. But we made it work. Allie. Huh? Fran wants a box. Hold on, I'm naked. Jesus Christ. <laughs> It'd be like that Not sometimes. Cheating. It's fine. What? Fran wants a box. She says okay. she's got good news. Fran. I don't, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't see no proof. What? Oh, that she was naked? Yeah, no proof. No, I just wanted to tell you that I got. She so, said pics or it didn't happen. <laughs> yeah, right. That's what I'm saying. You got You can't just say, "Oh, I'm naked." You got to prove that to me. Back, you can't just, back you can't describe just my boobs to her. Listen, she was getting in the tanning bed the other day and went to pick up her phone <laughs> and showed her whole ass tit. <laughs> it, 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 at least it ain't like my other. It's she has fine. Like the same titties. Just. It's Brian, big. get the fuck out of here. I'm not ready to deal with your bullshit tonight. 
Um, no, so I wanted to share you guys my good news. So I am getting my first house. My Ooh, first house. Big news. I love yeah. it. Hell yeah. I'm going to reach it by I'm 30. Like, that's my goal. That was my goal. By 30, I want to have a house. And that's what I'm doing, man. It's coming. Fuck I'm so yeah. excited. I'm so proud of you. Hell that's yeah. That's so exciting. Like, my kids are going to be so excited because the rooms are so like it has a bay area like a bay window my daughter's room does like it's it's gorgeous i'm so excited hell yeah so freaking happy for you house party at friends hey i'm telling you cook out say less sign me the fuck up <laughs> just please nobody bring some fucking macaroni and cheese with some fucking raisins in it because you will get kicked out real fast okay we're white but we're not what? That fucking white Macaroni and cheese with raisins? Yes, it's happened before. Is that a thing? It is. It is a thing. What the fuck? Disgusting. Where? It's like in Arkansas, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Where do you live that that's a thing? Remind me not to go there. <laughs> dude, it's Kansas, dude, so I'm just saying. <laughs> oh my god. My dog's eating something and I don't even know what she's eating okay. and I don't care enough to get up and look. Dude, that's what I guess with when I'm on the barbecue or the smoker, if the meat is not falling off the bone, it's not done right. That part. Ooh, now I want steak though, but I, ribs kind of sound good too. Macaroni with raisins. Mm -mm, yeah, that's, that, that's that white people shit. That's, that's not like that category. Not. I'm as white as they come. I am seasoned white people, okay? We don't do that here. Hell no. I'm getting tan finally. I seasoned the water I cooked my macaroni noodles in, bitch. Okay? I'm, don't ever funny. put me in that category with them white people. Yeah, it was funny because I'm, I'm getting a crunch membership. So they asked me, I was like, do you want a tanning? Because um, they have a tanning salon there. And I'm like, I'm black. I don't need it. <laughs> She's chewing on her bone that I gave her earlier. I thought she was chewing on something she wasn't supposed to be chewing on. She's chewing on the correct thing. Yeah. Has to be someone that broke them people. Right. Somebody hurt them. Where'd Beck can you go? Imagine, Beck that's what I'm saying. Like, can you imagine like a person that's never had any seasoning and the first time that they try something with season? Oh man, they see their eyes light up. They whole life change. <laughs> hey Beck, will you get the baby? Please, I want to see her. Huh? Can I see the baby? The baby. He just, he just got put up. Please, will you let me see her? Please, pretty, pretty, please. In, in just a minute. She's in there eating off her mama. I want to see her eat off her mama. Will you show me? Hell no, because there's like 12 more in there. And if I go in there, they all going to try to come out. Please, can I see them all? Yes, when they get done eating. No, I want to see them eat. I can't fuck with them while they eat. Just shh, 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 like, you don't guys, have to with them. Guys, guys, oh. shh, Satan's awake. Shh. Who's Satan? Oh, God. Beck knows who Satan is. God. Allie doesn't know who she Satan is. She's getting to get real. The, oh, the kid? Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. She's, she's picking her nose in her sleep. <laughs> That's, oh, Leave that baby alone. Oh, my God. <laughs> and today was the first day of when the kids' uh, winter break starts. They don't go back to school until the third. Ooh, nope. Mm -mm. Guess who's going to get my kid when she starts going on winter breaks? Her punk-ass daddy. I wish I could do that, but I'm also babysitting my niece, which she's the same age as my son, and then also mm -hmm. a 17 month old. So they can go to the punk ass daddy house too. Yeah, but this dude ain't shit. He ain't shit. But, 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 let's put it like this. I'm not not trying to like hopefully my sister ain't listening. Are you watch it. If she does, she gonna kill me. But this man won't even watch his own kids. She had to pay him last time to watch his own damn kids. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Absolutely not. Mm -mm. That's ghetto. We don't do that. Oh my goodness, I was going to take another pregnancy test. <laughs> <laughs> Spit 
Speaking I of just that, took one earlier. I'm solid. Dude, Nick, there's something you want to tell us? It's going to happen. And I was like super sick after eating those quesadillas tonight. I usually don't get sick from eating food. Oh, you eat breakfast. Mm -mm, because I got sick as fuck when I ate breakfast this morning and I was like, mmm, sus. Because I ate the same thing for breakfast every day. But I took that little pee test and it was negative. I said, thank you, Jesus. You better take another one. Okay, I'm gonna take I don't have another one. You I've, taken, one? I've taken two in the last two days and they're both negative. Oh. Like, I'm gonna take another one. If anybody in this chat ever wishes pregnant on me, I will come at y'all hard. Like, no, mm -hmm. I ain't having no more damn kids. Y'all better not put that evil on me. I don't value don't my sobriety enough for that. Look. I I have passed. I have passed. My kids are fucking independent as shit. My kids are nine and eight years old. They are independent. They are in school. That gives me eight hours where I can do what I want. Uh -uh. I don't need another time, comment? baby. Y'all see Julia's comment? I had a dream last night. I was pregnant. My tubes were tied, so it's one of y'all. Bitch, it ain't me. Don't you put that evil on me. I'm gonna put that evil on me. Don't you put that evil on me, Ricky Bobby. Don't you put that evil on me, Ricky Bobby. We know which one in the box ain't pregnant. Me. Me. Well, here's the thing. You have to have sex to be pregnant, and I haven't had sex in seven years. So, oh my I'm god, I'm so sorry. No, I'm not. I'm Shit, not. I am. <laughs> well, but, let's say like that no guy, no guy has ever made me reach completion, so I'm not really sorry. I can do better by myself. Girl, you need, you need to find a girl then, because they do it. No, 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 not girls either. Trust me, I've been with three girls and three guys, so no. Not at the same time. I gotta I gotta put that out there. Not at the same I time. I was about to say, I mean, I love that for you, but... Come on now. <laughs> I love that but, for you. But the thing about it is, like, I didn't know what I liked, you know, in Girl, that way. get you a rose, so yes, I oh do. God. Friend. You ain't gotta to make friends. Ew, fix your face. Quit cool looking like that. <laughs> Dude, I was over here trying to freaking pimp Beckiford out the other day, and he showed this terrible picture of him. And it literally scared everybody away. I don't need... Well, if they don't like it, they can get the fuck on. Okay, fine. I'll get the fuck on. Can't fucking be pretty 24-7. Dude, but you showed I, it trying to impress people. I'm not going to try to impress nobody. I am who I am. If they don't like it, oh well. Oh my Period. gosh, you're full of shit. Who? Anybody who says that is like kind of full of shit. Who? Oh. Like my grandma used to say, you're so full of shit that you sweet. I am 35 years old. I own my own business. And in the last four and a half to five months, I have made $36,000. I ain't trying to impress nobody. You either like it or you don't. I'm fine on my own. Love that for you. The thing too, like the line could be very faint because it would be very, very early on. My line didn't get dark with Charlie until I think I was like seven weeks. Yeah, that's why I'm saying it would be super early. Say no to babies. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's my motto for 2024. Say no to babies. Like, dude, I'm not even lying. Like, I'm going to babysit my niece, and I don't even know what the fuck to do. Like, I was telling my kids, I'm like... Be like, do you feed it? Like, <laughs> like, like, do I just poke it? Like, Do I have to watch it? <laughs> but staring well, at it, because you're going to get line eyes. Dude, it's like, she, she's 17 months old, so I haven't, I haven't, like, dealt with another, like, a baby baby overnight in such a long time. And my sister was like, here, she's going to have to sleep with you. I'm like... But I have a certain way I sleep. Like, it's my bed. I got to share it with that thing. Julia, I'm so serious. <laughs> because me and my ex-husband tried for four years to get pregnant. And if you stare at that motherfucker, you swear to God you see a line when you know it ain't no damn line there. Yeah, you can't just sit and stare at them. <laughs> but honestly, I don't mind watching my niece. She's my niece, but I will talk to a baby. Oh, yeah. Like I'll take head. all of my nieces and my nephew. Zero problems, but uh, having another one of my own, no, don't be me. Because I'm gonna give it right back to you. That's the one yep. thing about being an auntie or uncle. You could just be like, okay, yep. that's hers now. 
I'd be like, hey, come get your kid. Where the fuck? Danny eating is the most annoying thing you will ever see in your life. I don't know. I don't, I don't even watch them anymore. Like, honestly, dude. I've blocked them on every one of my accounts. I can't help it. It's way too entertaining. Oh, Beck has a nice butt. <laughs> no butt. <laughs> Oh shit! Back, Gifford. Let me see the baby. She's eating. I didn't. I saw her after she like just put it up. I see the baby. Oh, you're killing me. <laughs> and plus, I have a boy and a girl, so I'm good. I'm golden. I don't need no more damn kids coming out of me. I will have step. You know, she's from, like, my own. She was eating ice in the hospital and literally like I'm like, I don't oh, even know. Yeah, how no. I would have told her to shut the hell up. I don't know how somebody can eat that obnoxiously, to be honest. That is one of my biggest pet peeves. Damn, if I, I hear one. somebody chewing, that shit gives me all the anxiety. It pisses me off. I can't even <laughs> sit in the same room with my sister. Oh, baby girl. Oh, oh my god, god. streaming now. I can do both. Who's streaming us? No, huh? Nobody. Probably somebody. I, anybody, you know. People Let me see the baby's face. Ryder, oh. Ryder. Let Hi, me see mama. her face. No way. Let go. Ryder, Ryder. <laughs> Let me see the face. Hi, honey. Hi, Ray. That's Ray, right? Okay, it was okay. Ray Beckerford. Uh, Beckerford. Oh, he's the worst. Look at her little face. There. Yeah, now it's fixed. Back and I see the top of her. Ah, honey! Is that Ray? Fran, yep. um, what is that? Girl, you know what that is. Don't do that. It's that. Calm down, y'all. Calm down. What is Calm that? Down. I'm confused. I don't... I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> you know that you know the AI generator on Becky there? Bird, will you freaking let me see her face? She don't want to look at the camera. She keeps turning around. Rider, rider. I definitely can't see it when she's facing that way. Rider, rider. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. What are you doing, your little angel face? Hi, honey. Look at Rider. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, who's barking? <laughs> what is it, Ryder? <laughs> oh my oh. goodness. <laughs> Hi, Ray. <laughs> oh. Ryder. Hi, Ray Ray. She's gotten big. Yeah, he is right. getting big. Hey, get your face out of my chip bowl, <laughs> nigga. Hi, <laughs> sweetheart. Oh, Where's your okay. bone, sister? We need to teach her how to do TikTok. Somebody said we need a muzzle for Gabby, literally. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Right. You gonna go play? You gonna go play? All right. We'll I don't play. understand why Danny doesn't pluck her mole hairs. <laughs> hey, hi, baby. <laughs> Not her drinking again. Holy shit, Ryder. I do. I hate you. 
The mole hairs. I'm so serious. Not the mole hairs. Seriously, she has a mole with four hairs on it. Yeah. I don't understand why she doesn't just fuck them. Where's your bone, sister? Here's your names, I know. I gave it to you. Where's it at? Where's it at, sister? Where are you going? Where are you going? No, ma'am. Oh, you're so sharp, little girl. Yeah, riders are too. Rider. No, ma'am. Mm -mm. The teeth and the nails. Yeah, I'm talking about you, you little fucker. Hi, Ray. Ray, Ray. Ray, Ray. Ray, Ray. Ray, Ray. What names have you? What usernames? Tell me soon. Huh? Susie oh, said huh? usernames. Yeah, she's talking about in Gabby's chat. They have like, then they're making up all these freaking funny ass usernames. Somebody put Gabby's busted toe, Gabby's luggage, um, Aaron's attitude, Gabby's new Scooby snack, Whoopi oh. Goldberg. <laughs> I am barking because I'm trying to get the freaking dog's attention. Hi, Ray Ray. Oh, or your okay. stepmom, depending on how your daddy acts. You're right. I guess mom's gonna lay on top of my pillow. <laughs> I can't even see her. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ray Ray! Ray Ray! Ray Ray! Hi, baby! He's so bothered with life right now. <laughs> That's a tattoo that I want. Okay. I fussed with it. Oh my heavens. That's cute. Where do you want to get it? Don't think about it. Probably on my like leg or something, like on my thigh. I want a thigh tattoo, but I'm insecure about my thighs. Don't hurt. I got thick thighs. Thick thighs save lives. I don't give a fuck. Sell you I like have a thigh tattoo that goes from my knee all the way up to my hip. Hi, Ray Ray. Hi, to baby. It's a baby! He's, look, that dog is like, what the hell are you doing? Why are you showing him? She's so bothered with life wanna, at this point. She is. Dude, that dog, that dog She's so like, mad. Dog. He was asleep. Me me Wait, will you, will you put her on the ground and let me see her walk? <laughs> if she will. I want to see her in every position. <laughs> ew, ew. No, no, no. Don't say that. Uh -huh. I'm obsessed. <laughs> Hey Ashley. Hey, Ashley. Hi, Hi baby. Baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> baby. Ryder, if you don't pick somewhere and lay down, bro. Oh, I know. He's been My sister's dog is Y'all, he tried to right ditch now. me as a friend. Y'all heard that conversation the other night. Ain't nobody tried to ditch you as a friend. Uh, yeah, you did. They heard. No, I didn't. I told you I needed a break from TikTok. No, you didn't. You said you needed a break from me. Go back and read it again. Ray Ray. Hi, it's like honey. those it's like that it's like those girls that be online be like, He said that he doesn't love me no more. I thought all I said is just I'm not good, getting you food right now. It's cold outside. But that's the same thing. It is the same thing. She's one pound three ounces at four weeks. Oh my gosh. I would accidentally misplace her. Literally. <laughs> Serious. I'd lose her on accident. I'd accidentally put her in like a sock drawer or something. I had a hundred pound husky German shepherd mix and I stepped on that fucker enough. I'd kill a damn teacup dog. I've always wanted a teacup. Baby, we do it. She's freaking out. She don't like to be picked up. Ray, Ray. I, tea cup pig. I find teacup pigs are just the cutest. Hi, honey. Dog. How old is she? 
Uh, I really don't even know how many weeks they are now. I lost track. It's probably about five-ish weeks. How's, um, what, what's his name? Gunner, Gunner, Gunner. Scannon, yes. He's in his crate. I'm finna let him out. Uh, let him out? Did y'all hear that Nick Cannon's on thinking about having his, uh, what was it, 13th trial now? Oh, nope. Mm -mm. Doesn't he not take care of the first 12? Like, I feel like there should be, like, a law. Okay. Like, <laughs> don't take care of all of your children. You shouldn't be allowed to have a 13th. Are you ready for this? Yeah. Oh, oh. my God! If you don't get on that floor and cuddle them, Beckiford, you better cuddle those babies. This is the prettiest one to me besides her. Come here. I swear to God, I bet all those motherfuckers. But I love puppies. Yes. Oh, my God. That oh, oh, my God. Hang on. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at that baby. Oh, my goodness. Bitch, you are not going to chew on my baby. pants, you little shit. Don't talk to them like that, Beckifer. They have feelings too. So, oh, you hush. Come here. This is the fattest one. Ah! Oh, oh you look better at that. take that back. You better call him fucking look Oreo. At him. She's his so is, cute. His name is Oreo. Oreo. That's his name. That's Oreo. Just a baby. I just a baby. I can't wait till I lose some of my breath because every time I lay down, it just goes different ways. Hey, back no, for Let me see Gannon. <sighs> I'm telling you, I bet, I bet if you like lay down on the floor, the girl is getting puppy. Okay, no problem, hmm? I bet, I bet it was just like. Sharp and like those teeth. I know puppy teeth are just like, sharp as shit. Oh. Go outside, buddy. Beck, you have a comment to read. Who? You. Oh, he's good. He's back at home. So he still can't walk or nothing, but he's fine. How are you doing, Beck? Because I know the last couple days you weren't doing good with your heart and stuff. Um. I mean, I'm here, but, you know, I'm just taking it day by day. See Gannon? Yeah, he went outside to pee. Okay. And then you better hug that baby, because he didn't mean what he did the other day. Oh, no, I found out a whole story behind that. What do you mean? So, the other dog that my brother owns is a blue healer, and they don't get along. And... There's a gate in the hallway that keeps him from coming back here because he'll come back here and go through Gannon at the crate and try to attack him. Well, the last time he jumped on Gannon, Gannon nearly killed him. I had to, like, <laughs> to get him off of him and to let, make him let go, I had to put my hand around his esophagus and cut his airway off. Like, that's the only way I could get him off of him. Um, so, apparently the other day, while I wasn't here, they were back here doing something, and the dog's name is Rip. He got back here and tried to grab Gannon through the crate. Well, Gannon busted the gate open and grabbed him by the nose and had a hold of his nose and was trying to break his nose off. And when they got him put up, she come back here. After they had got him split up or whatever, she had come back here and went to get onto him or something and stuck her fucking finger in the crate and he bit her. Not my fucking mm -hmm. problem, not his problem. Nope, said, that's her fault. Me. Exactly. I've told them numerous fucking times when I'm not home, leave my fucking dog alone. You don't need to let him out. You don't need to mess with him. He's fine. I'll be back. They don't want to listen. Consequences are, you get bit. Let me see the baby. So. Let me see the baby, back at third. What's he doing? Come here. Come here. Baby, hi. We knew you was a good boy. We didn't Look doubt you. Look at that sweet boy. Oh, Gannon! Get it! So oh, wait, wait. I just want to give him such a big hug. I feel so bad for him. It makes me so sad. Wait, no, that's my phone. Wait. You were talking trash about him, Beck. You want to say you're sorry? Tell him you're sorry. No, I don't told him I'm sorry. This dog sleeps in my bed every night. He's okay. Don't no. Oh. Tell. I want to hear it. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Ow. 
Sweet boy. You're a sweet baby. Yeah, we talked your daddy out of putting a bullet in your head the other day. You sweet baby. Look at his little face. How can you be mad at him? You can't be. Ah, baby. Hi. He loves you. Thank you. Thank you. Good night, Heather. Hi, Heather. Uh, Cannon! What? Cannon! Come here. Come here. No, Cannon. over here. Over here. Come here. Come here. Here. No, get, get up oh, here, Jake. Come here. Come here. Come here. That's what we're going to do. We're going to save up for me to get a dog. Okay. Here he is. Here he is. Cannon! Hi, Cannon! You're a good boy! Send a big old cuddle bug. Oh, hello! Send a big old cuddle bug. Allie Ray's fan page. Allie Ray's fan page just joined. Hey, Allie Ray's fan page. What up, bitches? Sweet baby boy. Hi, honey. Aw, oh, you the big yawn. Hi, Cannon. Him said, I just want some love from my dad. Oh. oh that's Dan's How old is he again? He's five and a half or six. Right around in there. Poor baby. You were almost so mean to him. My poor boy, you didn't do nothing wrong, baby. Tenet, you an angel face. You didn't do nothing wrong, sweet boy. Where you going? No, where you going? That's mine. No, that's mine. I shot. You better nope. rub his belly. <laughs> oh, where you going? No, no, kisses. I want your kisses. Oh. I want him. Wait, no, come here. No, wait, no, wait. Wait, come here. No. Wait, come here. Look, no, wait, stop. Look, 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 look. Get in. No, wait, come here. Look, John. Say, Get in. Give me some of yours. Oh, oh did you do it? Oh. Mm. Huh? Come here. Come on. Oh shit! Hey! Hey! Come here! Come on! Come on! Oh wait, no, son! Oh Jesus! Him said, "Okay, Dad, I'm good. I will lay down." Ah, honey. Gosh, I love dogs way more than I, I love I love when they lay upside down and you can see their little top teeth. <laughs> right still. No, come here. Look. Smile. <laughs> Don't hit them! I have to do this. Him such a sweet baby boy. <laughs> Hi. Are you going to hold my hand? Okay. And so sweet. I swear the dog that I'm babysitting for my sister. <laughs> All these baby counts are so funny. He snores like a motherfucker. Like, this dog snores so loud. Oh, shit. Bless you. Bless you. That sneeze was so hard it hurt my soul. Shit. Dude, you, you have about a soul? That hurt. You know what? You love me. Somewhere in the air deep. You want to know how old I am, dude? I was, was laying on the couch the other day, and I sneezed, and I popped my back. Dude, I felt that. <laughs> Gannon, you want to show me you good boy? You want to show me you good boy? Get in your bed. Oh, I know you don't fucking make him sleep on the floor. No. Okay. Good. He just lays down there while I'm not in the bed. Let me see I him. Mean, he, Becca, he lays on the bed, too. Look at him and you. Hey, you see the baby? 
The baby went back to bed. No, oh, let me see the baby. Just turn the camera on the baby. Ah, candy! Ah! He's just hanging out. Oh, oh, he's such Daddy. a good boy. You better Daddy give him extra love for being mean to him the other night. Sweet baby. Oh, he went to the dog park, got half a steak. Have you seen that video on TikTok where it's like dogs, they, they stitch the videos like dogs shouldn't sleep in people's beds? Like Hell no, my dog had her own pillow and her own fucking blanket in my bed. And slept with me every night. Yeah, Better not yeah. nobody ever tell me that my dog don't belong in my bed, bitch. Shut up. That's what I'm gonna do. The only thing the dog I can't should do... I get, guys, we're gonna save up for one since I'm gonna be getting unemployment and working. I don't know. It depends on what type of dog you want. Like, you, are, do you live a very active lifestyle? If not, then you need to get a less active breed. Like a great Pyrenees. Them uh -huh. motherfuckers just lay around. That's true. They're so big. They are. I love them. I had one. My my daughter just saw a great day today, and she was like, "That's a big dog." And I was like, "Yeah, it is." Like a that is a horse. horse. There's a freaking muscle tone on his shoulder. He's so fucking huge. Hi, Gannon. Hi, honey. Oh, such a good boy. A good boy. And said, "I'm just loving on my dad." <laughs> Hi, honey. Oh, I'm good. just loving on my dad. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, Gannon. Yeah. Uh, no. You better boop his now. Boop his now. You have to boop the snoot. Look, you gotta look, boop look. it. No, that's a, no, you got, hey. He doesn't want to be booped. Oh, well, he doesn't know what you're doing. Bring him back over. Call him off. Uh -huh. Look at him. He said, fuck y'all ain't getting my snoot boot. No, 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 no. I want to see you boop look. it. No, hold still. Look, no, come. No, 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 look. No, you, look, you got to come here. Look, 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 come here. No, no, you got to come up here. Look, come here. Look, no, you got to come up here. Look, okay, stay. stay. No, hey, up here. Nope, up here. Stay, 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 stay. Boop. Wait, no. Nope. Hey, you better do it again. Nope. Face down. Ah! Move. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this is my baby. Cannon. Hi, honey. Mom said, I just want to love on my dad. Hi, Cannon. Cannon. <laughs> No, mine's sleeping. <laughs> you been... Good boy. Aw, I got a sweet baby. That boy. Where is she sleeping at? Is she still on your pillow? Yep. There she is. Oh, she's just a baby. How old is she again? Uh, I think she's like six. Six ish weeks, six, seven. I heard it's a baby too. She doesn't ever piss in your bed in the middle of the night? Nope. It's in bed too. I want to get a golden doodle really bad, but. I just got freaked out by the tattoo on my arm just now because all I saw was her face next to me. <laughs> oh, really? Dude, I get freaked out by my own height, so I'll sit down for a little bit and then stand up and I'm like, oh shit. You oh. like, wait a minute. Should I start I doing I diamond could... paintings, guys? Dude, those are so satisfying. Are they? This girl is I... always doing them. Hell she yeah, sells... I love them. She sells them for like insane prices too. <laughs> I don't know yeah, because do everyone that. wants one, but they're too lazy to do that shit themselves. I would get very frustrated with that. I'm not good with stuff like that. Yeah, and sell them like Gabby, right? I could pretty much do that as a full time job, huh? Do people actually buy hers? I know, it's boring right now, huh? I'm so sorry. Right. 
I'm just waiting for my kids to go to fucking sleep so I can go to sleep because I got to clean my house tomorrow. Even yeah, though I know. I'm fixing to go to bed. I'm, I'm like, literally, if, if I showed you my house right now, you'd probably be like, oh, it's not even fucking dirty, friend. I'm like, well, to me it is. I'm that That's person. how I'm I am with sleep. my house right now. It's not dirty, but it's dirty to me. Yeah, like, hold on. I'll show you my front room. I'm not sure. <laughs> Like, yep, there's my front room. Why is my kid never in bed? That's crazy. <gasps> Dude, yours is like mine. But like, this is this is dirty to me. For real, this is dirty to me. That's my front room. This my is dirty one. to me. Y'all have so much space. Mine's just a giant open studio. That's why it looks like I have a lot more space than I do. I mean, and it's a mess space, but the mess up part is I've been in here for five years. I'm very, I'm not a materialistic kind of person. I don't like because the more stuff that you have, I feel like the more clutter it is, and the more like mm -hmm. I can't. I like, just when my kids shit in the trash. Dude, I'm telling you, when my kids were cleaning out their rooms because they wanted to switch rooms, they do that from now. I'm like. They do that every now and again. They like to switch rooms. So they put everything out in my front room. And when I said I almost had a fucking anxiety attack, dude, I cannot deal with clutter. I feel like very claustro. Like not claustro, but like just like, ah, I want it done. Get it done. <laughs> yes. And it, like, I, I like, I'm go going through my daughter's room tonight, to, uh, tomorrow. And we're going through her shit because she has a lot of shit for no reason. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, I'm going to bed. I love your faces. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Okay, oh, hey, will you send me that link when you get the chance? You can wait till tomorrow if you want. Yes. Okay, appreciate you. Bye. 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 I'm waiting for my kids, for my, for my son to finally, finally go to sleep. <laughs> Back at first. So I'm that kind of mom that I cannot go to sleep until my kids are all the way asleep. Yeah, but that's kind of good. Well, how old are your kids? Nine and eight. Oh, yeah. I I'm about understand. to have a fucking... Yeah, I'm about to have a double-digit daughter. Like, she'll be 10 in June. And I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> I told her she's like, here. I'm consumed with Gabby right yeah. now. You Things happening. She's just doing her diamond painting. Like legitly, my daughter's like, I can't wait till I'm 18. I'm like, you understand? The more that you age, I'm gonna die, right? Like, <laughs> she, she even said it to me. She was like, she was like, because we did this TikTok filter, like a life update or whatever. And I don't post my kids on TikTok, but I use the filters on them sometimes. And she, her said her said all alone and i was like oh you're not gonna be alone you're gonna have me and she's like not until you, no I'll, you'll die you'll be dead i'm like oh geez thanks like fuck so i met this girl on bumble oh. and you know i asked her what she does for work and she told me she works at this like trip club <laughs> as a dancer and Go go get some ones and throw it at her. I told her that um, oh, I was looking for a job, and she was like, "Well, you can come work here if you want to give dancing a shot." I was like, uh -huh, "No," but Dude, I, I was like thinking about being like a cocktail waitress or whatever. But they smoke in there. Dude, I'm not even gonna lie. Strippers make a lot of fucking money. They do. They make bank. Yeah, but you also have to subject your body. I see that's just like no matter how broke I've been. All right. Please be a dancer, y'all. I got two left feet over here. I feel like Beck would be the first one there. Kayla, did you get my DM or no? I feel like Beck would be the first one there. He's like, okay, where you at? Yeah, I Beck, mean, I'm a dancer. Would you come see me? I've already seen the titty, so. The rest is better. <laughs> Bro, I can't be showing those for free. Right. <laughs>
<laughs> Dude, that's the one thing. Like, I've never been that desperate. Like, my friend was telling me, you should post your feet on feet finder. And I'm like, I'm not doing all that. Huh? Right now. Don't get me wrong. I will sell my feet all day, every day. Huh? Really? I can't oh, do absolutely. that. Oh, absolutely. My feet? Absolutely. Anybody want to buy my feet pictures? I will sell them right here, right now. No, Kayla, I didn't. Huh? I don't know. I just... I feel like there's just like when you when you when you do that, it just opens up a door for like really weird shit. Like there's this girl on TikTok that was selling her fucking farts for in a jar for money. No, if anybody wants to buy my bath water, my feet pictures, or my farts, I will sell all that shit. And I remember this like because this is one of my friends. She actually told me about this. Her name's Mo, and she told me. Um, in the comments, you met her before. She was in the comments. She told me oh, that this one dude wanted her to wear the underwear for a week and then send it to her. Send I will also her. do that. As long as I don't. I feel like there's just some weird ass people out there. Like, I just can't. Like, I'm in the king of shit. Too, but, like, there's just. Come here, baby. No. I would never like do anything sexual for money, nor would I like sell nudes or anything for money. But like, to me, feet is not like a sexual thing. And sure, they can you want more and ask for more, but then you're gonna get more. Come here. Is that your daughter? My niece. Gannon, Gannon, get in your bed. Come on. In your bed. Go lay down. Lay down on that side. Over there. Does she want to sleep with you? She's scared of the dark. So she comes back here and falls asleep, and then I put her in her bed sometimes. Oh, Beckiford. Julie, I got your message. Yes. Yeah, baby. Hold on. Like it's right. Hey, life. listen, you guys have a very, very long road trip tomorrow, okay? So you need to get to sleep, okay? Because you have to get up very early in the morning. Where are they going? They're going to Tennessee. They're driving? Uh, huh? They're driving? <laughs> yeah, it's only like a, it's only like a 10-hour trip. Oh. I'm going to turn this off, okay? But I'm right here. Here, I'll turn this. Can I go up there? Is that good? No, yes. Okay. Try to get this. Can I go up there? Hello? What? You're not going with? No, I'm not going with him. I gotta work. Zach's supposed to call me again tonight, so I doubt it, but we'll see. <laughs> God. I have never met a person that'd be like, okay, let's go to a road trip to Kansas. <laughs> never. There's nothing really in Kansas. I don't want to play no games, play no games, fuck around, give you my last name. Back with side eye, I laugh so hard. Dude, he's ridiculous with that damn side eye. <clears throat> yeah. And that's, your, that's your new profile picture for me. Hey, Beckaford, you know what I might do? What? I might fuck around and give you my last name. <laughs> Jeez. What? <laughs> oh, I need to sleep. Roll over and get to sleep. Okay. Hey, Beckaford, what's your last name? <laughs> <laughs> you don't think I'm funny? Beck Ray? Uh, 
<laughs> my last name is Joanna Man. Who? Joanna Man. Hell no. <laughs> Beck knows. Beck got it. Hell no, friend. <laughs> Beck got it. Beck got it. Uh uh. Oh, I love you, Joanna Man. Mm mm. Oh, I'm so proud. I, I, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad somebody got that. I'm, so, I'm really glad. That just well, shows how the cool factor that you're on. Well, we just showed our age with that one's all it is. <laughs> Dude, I should totally watch that again tonight. That was a good movie. I haven't Ooh. watched that shit in so long. Ooh, here's another one. Here's another one that was showing my age. Cootie Tang. You did not. <laughs> yes, I did. Outlandish. <laughs> Does anybody know what they're talking about? What? You don't know what... Oh, here's another one, Beck. Undercover brother. Yeah. Come on now. Come on no. now. You're going to make me have to go back and watch all this shit. That was a glass. It sounded that way. Did it break? I don't wanna no. play no games, play no games. Fuck around, give you my last name. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Can I get an oh yeah? Ooh, remember the pest? <laughs> Tomorrow I work at ten thirty. Remember the pest deck? The what? The pest. Oh, say it ain't so.